YouTube. I haven't vlogged for so long I've forgotten how and frankly I haven't driven enough in the last six months to remember how either. I got in the car, forgot to put my earphone in. Of course you know that'll make the phone ring. Luckily it didn't but I forgot to secure my phone and then um, I had a sudden stop and the phone went flying. So then I had to find a place safe to pull over and get it so we didn't end up under my gas pedal or something and that took about a mile and a half and there was just no place safe or legal to stop so it was just kind of a challenging morning and then of course i started to vlog and my um phone rang and it was the friend that i'm meeting this friend is also my daughter's mother-in-law a lovely lady and we're gonna go walking on the los angeles river um it is a cement river you've all seen in movies. It's really just a drainage ditch, but apparently they spent it over top of the river. I'm a little confused on that part. But anyway, it is currently an artwork in progress. I guess a lot of artists have been invited to paint the cement walls, and I'm excited to see it from inside. I've seen it from above, but we're going to go down and walk where we can see it nicely. So that'll be cool. And then after that, we are going to... Um, tour the San Antonio Winery, which is very close by, like two miles away, and maybe have a bit of lunch. So that'll be fun. Um, I think I, a lot of you probably know from Facebook that we went ice skating for my daughter's 35th birthday. And my son, who's almost four years older, was doing really well, and then he hit a bad patch of ice or deep puddle actually boom went down and cracked his kneecap yes he did he cracked his kneecap so we were at the ER with him and oh my gosh it was this horrible dirty dirty hospital and there were sick people coughing and choking and nobody covering their mouths and touching things and nobody washing their hands and of course I don't touch anything. My son doesn't touch anything. Hubby, he just touches everything. So of course, he's sick as a dog still. This is a week and a half later. And he is runny-eyed and runny-nosed and coughing and choking and sneezing until you could just... I, I could feel sorry for him or I could be mad. It's just so sad. So he's really sick. Um, son of course is um, one-legged and you know you can't bend that knee you're not allowed to put any pressure on it walking around on the other leg with crutches and yada yada luckily he didn't have to have a cast he has um, an immobilizer it's called it's like a brace which is really nifty and um, he can take it off and shower and stuff and um, after having been in a cast for 12 weeks last sum two summers ago I can tell you how wonderful that is. I would have paid anything, anything, for a shower at that point. Oh golly, I had to put my leg in a big giant garbage bag and it was, it was something. So he's very happy to be able to get in and out of the shower and have more mobility than I did. The crack, cracks, there are two of them. They don't go all the way through, they're pretty, severe but they don't go all the way through so his kneecap is still in one place piece and um, if he treats it properly it will remain so I imagine it's already knitting together because his swelling is going down and down and down so I've been waiting on the two of them hand and foot for the last two weeks and um, we can have whatever and um, when Penny said let's go out and play I thought you bet because they're both well enough to manage and stumble around and care for one another today so today's my day to go out and play. I hope to get some video of the river or the hike or maybe even the winery later. Um, I make no promises. And I hope I can get this back out of my camera because the last one I took about my February project would not come out. So I've completely wiped the card. I hope I saved everything I tried. And um, we'll see what we see. Thanks for watching, bye.